running social media accounts is actually a hassle for me and I hate it. In this video, I'm gonna show you how I use a software called Later to batch off my Instagram content creation and try to be more productive that way. Everybody, what's up and welcome to another segment of Weapon of Choice. In this week's video, I want to share a tool that I use to schedule my Instagram posts. Instagram is actually um, one of the hard things for me. So creating posts for Instagram is it takes me way more time than it takes me creating these YouTube videos. Um, and it's more of a pain. And I've found out that when I try to do it once every few days, it takes up so much mental effort. And so it really makes sense for me to try to batch it together in kind of like one to three hours of creating that content, scheduling it for the rest of the week, because it makes sense uh, when people are more active and to kind of create um, a pace of posting on Instagram. And so I was looking for a software to help me do this. And I found later, let me show you how it looks and works. I've been working with it for a few months now, and I'm pretty happy with it. Basically, you have here your media library where you update media, and uh, then you have your calendar here. And you can actually preview and see maybe how your feed looks like if you wanna make sure that it looks um, well. I don't actually look at the preview because um, I don't really care about how my feed looks, I guess, but um, I do use this kind of a week where I'm choosing a post. I'm just dragging it so um, to whenever I think is a good time, so maybe here, and then actually write the caption here. Also, writing captions on the uh, mobile while uploading for Instagram is such a hassle, especially if you want to write a lot of content in your post. So doing that on the desktop really makes my life easier. So I just write the uh, caption here and then I can just do auto publish. Now you can do auto publish, which just update, um, does it for you. You don't even have to think or remember this, but for specific posts, for example, carousel posts, for some reason you can't auto post them. So you need to get kind of a notification from the app. So I have the app later app also installed on my phone. They will, uh, once you schedule it, when the time arrives, it'll, you'll get a notification that says, Hey, you need to open the app. You're going to click, you know, post this now. It's going to take you to Instagram just to upload all the photos. You're going to and copy and bring in the text that you wrote on the computer into your kind of like um, the memory, um, copy paste memory. So you're just going to paste the text there and uh, post it. So it's going to take you like 20 seconds versus, you know, setting that all up and doing it yourself. Um, obviously, I'd much rather do the auto posting, but for things like carousel, which right now works really, really well, you have to do this manually. Also, I think for um, if you want to post stories or if you want to post videos or stuff like that, that's going to be manual. But for me doing just image posts and scheduling it this way and then not even thinking about this um, saves up a lot of time. I actually, um, I've used this, um, let me just leave without canceling, um, without saving this. I've actually used this, I think, for free for a while, and then I've uploaded mainly to get the analytics. So this is pretty helpful for me in terms of understanding which posts get good engagement, how's my you know following count uh, grows. So that's why I actually pay them the premium account um, for the premium account. I only use this for um, Instagram, but you can also use this for Twitter, Facebook, these type of things. And again, for me, just reducing the mental overload of running my social media is really important. I try to be productive besides and do other things besides create uh, content and manage my social media. So that's really helpful. Um, if you have other strategies, I'd love to know what tools you're using to run your social media. And uh, so let me know and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.